Today on Vital People, a benefit concert to help immigrants and refugees. As we see next, this effort supports their mental health and helps them recover from trauma. When I was uh, 12 years old, the uh, revolution in Hungary, that was my country, has broken out. And my family and I then had to escape to Austria. We were in refugee camps. We arrived to Canada, just like any other refugees at the present time. The trauma Adrian Carter lived through set her on a lifelong path of healing others. At that time, there was not much uh, mental health assistance available to people who have suffered trauma. So because of that, I have learned what I would have liked to have but didn't have. For many years, Adrian worked overseas in war-torn countries, setting up mental health teams to support traumatized people. Returning to Victoria in 2015, Adrian and a colleague co-founded the Vancouver Island Counseling Centre for Immigrants and Refugees. We had no money, so we each put in $500, and that's how the centre was started. Are you still having nightmares at night? The centre has more than 30 professional counsellors and translators volunteering their services to all ages. Well, the, the need for counselling is, is, is really the first thing that settlement organisations should be thinking of, because we, we need to do an assessment of where people are emotionally. Anna moved to Victoria from Spain five years ago. I have a background in law, mediation, counseling, what can I do here? So I thought that this is a perfect place also to come and contribute to my new community in Canada. Sarah, born in Syria, volunteers as a translator and the stories can be heart-wrenching. It's always hard um, and we always have difficulties as interpreters to um, be neutral and to avoid having emotions or attachment to the situation. Part of um, overcoming this trauma that we feel during the sessions is a debriefing with the counselor. We have a few minutes after the session to talk to the counselor and explore how we felt. People want to share their stories. They never forget what happened to them, but many of the symptoms that they come in with really decreases and very often disappears. To help fund this vital work, the Centre is holding a benefit concert, a blend of Eastern and Western music, Saturday, December 15th at St. Peter's Anglican Church. Vital People is brought to you in part by the Victoria Foundation, connecting people who care with causes that matter.